Turning to a different story now, NASA recently released a study that shows air pollution patterns around the world over the last decade. The changes in air pollution patterns are not random and are mostly related to human activity. Son jung in tells us more. Using new high-resolution global satellite maps of air quality indicators, NASA scientists analyzed trends in nitrogen dioxide levels around the world from 2005 to 2014. Nitrogen dioxide is a pollutant emitted by automobiles, power plants, and industrial activity. Compared to the map 10 years ago, China saw an increase of 20 to 50 percent of nitrogen dioxide, much of it occurring over the middle west of China due to the rising use of coal for power. Seoul had the joint fifth highest level of nitrogen dioxide. Only Beijing, Guangzhou, Tokyo and Los Angeles had worse air quality than the South Korean capital. But on a brighter note, Seoul's concentration level has decreased by 15 percent over the last decade. Three major Chinese metropolitan areas, Beijing, Shanghai and the Pearl River Delta, also saw nitrogen dioxide reductions of as much as 40 percent. The U.S. and Europe are among the largest emitters of nitrogen dioxide, but both regions showed the most dramatic reductions between 2005 and 2014. This was largely due to their efforts to reduce air pollution through environmental regulations. Son Jung-in, Arirang News.